Two people have died and hundreds of others have been injured after a magnitude 5.6 earthquake shook the Indonesian island of Java. Over 13,000 people have been displaced so far and over 2,000 homes have been heavily damaged. This from Sky News. Indonesia is used to earthquakes, tsunamis and volcanic uh, eruptions, but it doesn't take away from the devastation often felt when you have so many casualties. In the last few hours, that figure has tripled. Earlier, we were reporting around 50 deaths. Now that figure is at 162 people that have died as a result of the earthquake. Now, the footage that we're currently looking at used to be a supermarket, but you can see now that it's turned into rubble, and according to the National Disaster Mitigation Agency. This is likely the lead cause of most deaths and injuries. And of course, hundreds of people have now been injured as a result of the earthquake. And we've also seen chunks of concrete lying around on the ground, as well as tiles falling around people and people desperately running out of buildings, trying to escape the collapse of those buildings. We're actually looking at the moment at live footage of a hospital or outside side of a hospital. This is where lots of people locally have been taken to get their injuries looked at. And we have heard the governor from West Java confirming that 162 people have now died. And unfortunately, that number could well climb as emergency services and rescue workers are able to try and identify people that may be caught under the rubble of collapsed buildings. And of course, it will be a mammoth task, especially when these rescue teams will need to go to the more isolated areas and villages as well 